Well, according to the USDA's September 11th crop production report, Louisiana farmers planted an estimated 110,000 acres of cotton this year, making 2015 the lowest cotton acreage year in history. Years of low prices forced many farmers to turn away from cotton, but one Franklin Parish farmer explains why he remains faithful to his crop of white gold. Across the Louisiana Delta, fields of waving white gold signal the start of cotton harvest. And for Jack Daly, this is the most wonderful time of the year. I just personally like it. <laughs> I mean, it's, uh, it's an interesting crop because in the first thing, you're taking a perennial plant and you're growing it as an annual. So that's always a challenge. Daly says that cotton has always been a staple on his farm in Franklin Parish. But this season's low prices force him to cut back his crop to 200 acres. All commodities are cyclical. They've always been and they'll continue to be. So that's another reason we like the diversity of having uh, corn, soybeans, and cotton in our rotation mix. As the markets go up and down over time, Daly says that one thing remains constant. Cotton is woven into the history of his family farm. Including my ancestors, I mean, we've been farming cotton since the 1820s. As far as I know, even during the flood year of 1927, uh, we've always had a cotton crop on our farm. That's another reason we're kind of reluctant to leave the crop, because it's been a, a good, uh, stable industry for our farm. He says growing cotton will not only preserve his heritage, but it's also supporting the future of the industry. We are in danger in Louisiana of losing our infrastructure because the acreage has crashed so much. Where I'm ginning now is 30 miles away from our farm. Where we used to gin was a mile away from our farm. So we have to keep a base acreage in the state, but th that can come back with price. Right now prices are depressed, but it, it doesn't take very much of an increase in price if we can have yields like we're picking today to make cotton very competitive with corn or soybeans in our area. Despite the ongoing trend of low prices, there could be a silver lining for the future of cotton. Commodity experts say that low gas prices could cause an increase in cotton consumption, resulting in higher prices for the following year.